For the last 25 years, passionate golf professionals and enthusiastic believers now in their second generation have lived the most sought-after lifestyle experience in golf. This is PGA West. As we currently celebrate 25th anniversary for PGA West, folks, it's amazing to look back over the history and the tradition. There it is. There it is. His 13th tour title. In the hole! In the hole! Oh, oh my oh, goodness, my right back. You've got to be kidding me. Yeah. 59, the best final round There's nowhere else in the world, truly, that you can go and find a finer collection of golf, uh, a finer community of people, and the most amazing environment that you could possibly imagine. The members are really the key to success. The members are the ones that really put this together to make it what it is today, and they will be the ones that will make it successful going forward. PGA West, you know, is set a standard for golf, unparalleled in the United States, I think. PGA West opened for membership in 1985, but the story of how this desert landscape was transformed into a golfing mecca begins many years earlier. When I was a kid growing up here, I never would have thought that it would have uh, developed, La Quinta would have developed like it has. What is now PGA West was all being farmed. There was no raw desert left. The feedlot that was on the stadium course, we pastured cattle in the fields around it. This quaint Coachella Valley town caught the attention of pro golfers Ernie Vossler and Joe Walser, who set in motion what is now a true golf icon. In the very beginning, we drove people out in, on four-wheel drives out over this stupendous terrain that was my favorite stadium golf course. And they were blown away by what looked like was going to be a, a fabulous course. The original PGA West sales trailer was terrific. We had a trailer up above the 18th green. There was a little road runner that came to our door every day and we'd feed this road runner. So it was really country. This was not downtown Palm Springs by a long shot. But when we sold 500 memberships before we even opened, people realized we had something going here. This was not going to be the boondocks for long. It all started with Joe Walser and Ernie Vossler allowing these great champions of the game, but also great champions of architecture, to come out and do as, uh, as good as they possibly could do. Uh, and they, they inspired each other. We tried to build a friendly golf course, one that people could enjoy, uh, not just the pros who were playing the tour, but guys that were uh, good players, but not top of the world. They were, and, and we did that. We did a golf course, I think, and of course I enjoy it. Uh, the older I get, the more I enjoy playing it. It's really hard to believe that it's been 25 years since Alice and I were in the desert building the PGA Stadium golf course. And they said they wanted me to make a, a really a, a hard golf course. It's one of the prime, prime golf courses of my lifetime is the PGA Stadium course. Through the years, uh, I've had a great association out there at PGA West. It was really fun to be able to do two really nice golf courses. Uh, both of them have been good tests of golf. Uh, Ernie always wanted good tests of golf. Uh, he always wanted to have things that uh, stood out and, 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 and lasted over time. When we got going, the interesting thing about this, I'll never forget this, it's never been duplicated yet in my 23 year career as a designer is we built this golf course, started on day one, and in 14 months, they were playing it. 
When PGA West asked me to design their sixth course in 1997, we agreed it would be an environmentally sensitive design featuring a water conserving desert landscape. We started with an old sod farm and transformed it into an incredible desert links surrounded by the spectacular Santa Rosa Mountains. There it is. There it is. Look at what we've, what we've actually had here over the last 25 years. The Bob Hope Classic, the Liberty Mutual Legends of Golf. We've had the Grand Slam. We've had PGA Championships here uh, for the golf professionals across the United States. And shots like Trevino made on, on Alcatraz, the Island Green there, the hole in one in the Skins game. When it was in the air, Jack said that's a pretty shot. It can't get any prettier than that. The birdie at the final hole by David Duvall, who was the world's number one at the time, to, to become one of uh, a handful of players to shoot 59. Uh, Arnold's involvement in, in basically the Bob Hope for decades. If I could play golf like anybody in the world, I'd like to play like our guest tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, the man with the golden arms, Mr. Arnold Palmer, right here. Bob Hope gave us all a, a, an example that we can barely even keep up with or fathom what he did for uh, the military, setting all those standards and traditions. And, and I think all of us, I, I don't even know if, if I would think about the USO as much as I do and, and go do those tours if it hadn't been for Bob. We've had a lot of presidents play, and, and of course, uh, Jerry Ford was famous in his own right. They didn't uh, say four when he hit the ball, they said duck. <laughs> As the next chapter begins, much lies ahead for this storied community that can pride itself in having achieved unprecedented international recognition. Well, the future of golf, as we all know, um, uh, is going to be about the hospitality and the execution of the experience. But every day you look out here, it's fun to put smiles on people's faces. 25 years old, that means that you guys are legal now. Yes. Right? 18, 19, 21, you can start drinking. <laughs> well, happy 25th anniversary to the membership, obviously. Uh, you guys don't look that old. I love it here at PG West, obviously the weather's fantastic, the golf courses are amazing. Uh, great group of designers designing this golf course and uh, great practice facility, so it's uh, probably one of the best in the country. After 25 years, I would like to say thank you, and I would also like to congratulate you on, on an amazing ride. Just know that this will be the western home of golf in America forever. There's nothing like PGA West anywhere in the world. Congratulations and happy 25th anniversary. You outlasted me. I never thought that would happen, but I sure do love you all. Thank you. Has it really been 25 years for PGA West? Congratulations. Believe me, you set a standard in this golf industry that is almost unparalleled. I want to say that I'm proud to be a, been part of PGA West, part of the 25 years, and uh, I want to wish uh, all you members out there uh, uh, a good anniversary and uh, hope that uh, you enjoy your golf and play a lot of golf out there on those Nicholas Golf Courses. And uh, uh, if you want something easy, you can go over and play that stadium course. That's the way I look at it. Happy anniversary, PGA West, and we hope to see you soon at the Norman course. To be here and to be able to congratulate PGA West on the silver anniversary, 25 years. Isn't that wonderful? And to think it's only beginning. They'll be here for many, many years to come and to have been a part of it and to see what is happening and hope it will continue for many, many more years. And I thank you for the opportunity to say congratulations on 25 great years.